Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to summon in all the bionic skins, at least all the skins that are out currently. So, oh and I'm also wearing the cool corrupted avatar skin. I believe that's what it's called. Let's double check. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, without further ado, to start off, we're going to summon off all these guys. And it's a skin. So it's not a actual dinosaur. Although, I think there's codes for that too. If you want just the whole dinosaur to be that, let me know and I'll make a video on that. But for now, I'm just going to show you how to summon in the skins so you can just put it on the dino that you probably already have. So, to start off, the raptor. Raptor's pretty sweet. Give you a good look at it. <laughs> pretty cool looking. And I discovered that you can use um I don't know what he's called. The coloring. The consumables. What the heck was that? Anyway. You can use the coloring items and you can colorize it however you want. So if you wanted the cool like spikes or whatever, the blue spikes to be green or red or whatever, you can change the color, which is awesome. Just like changing clothing color. And then after the raptors, next is the parasaur. One of the best starting dinos as far as speed and just getting, you know, getting around the map. Not very useful for fighting, but it it helps you detect other dinos and I don't know, it's to be honest, it's been so long since I've used one. <laughs> They've updated it a couple times. And I think this skin looks really cool on it. That's the Parasaur. Next is my probably my favorite one of the tech armor is the Triceratops. I just love how the head turned out. It's awesome. funny you used to have to buy these skins. Now you can just summon them in. So I ended up buying them all back when I first played it. Oh, he took a deuce. And uh, I found out later that, oh, you don't need to buy it. <laughs> I mean, they're only 99 cents, so it's not like I spent a lot of money. Yeah, that's my favorite one. Especially when you change the colors. And the Stego. That one's pretty sweet. Because of all the cool spikes. Stupid sunlight. Sorry about that. There you go, I can get a better look at him. So yeah, you can colorize it, you can change the color of the spikes. It looks really cool with the tail too. <laughs> what the heck? Next up is the Quetzal. Probably my least favorite flying type, because he can't walk backwards. It's like a giant, like, immovable... Here, let me fly up here a little bit. Ugh. Come on, there we go. He looks really cool though. In his robot form. That is the robot skin, or bionic skin is what it's called. Or the Quetzal. Then next up is the T Rex. Kind of looks a little spooky looking, like I'm going to murder you. <laughs> it's pretty cool looking. I prefer the normal T Rex with the tech saddle. I think that's cool. I don't know, there's just something about his face I just don't like. Little beady eyes or something. Should have made him more... I don't know. But the rest of him looks cool. I was hoping they'd make a whole map like this. All tech. Like the trees be tech. You know, the ground's all like robotic or metallic looking. I think that'd be cool just for like a, a fan map. I mean, they already have a bunch of them already robotic. They could just do a bunch more. They have like cybernetic parts sticking on them. They don't have to be full robotic, but... Anyway, and then the Gigantosaurus Rex. This is my second favorite one because he's so damn big. <laughs> His face looks really cool. If he stops looking at me for a second. Cool eyeballs light up. And you can change the color of that as far as I remember. So if you want red eyes or something. Let's just double check when we're done here. So that is the Gigantosaurus. Just to give you a size comparison, you're only about, uh, yeah, that big. <laughs> Gigantosaurus Rex for a reason. 
And if you don't have the achievement uh, for writing one, let me know and I'll make a video on how someone won it. But yeah, I just think that's really cool looking. <laughs> Hands look awesome too. Anyway. So let's see if we can change the color real quick before I end the video. It's so big it like barely moving. <laughs> color. Yeah, see? See how it's changing a little bit? My, I mean, I don't have blue on me. But if you wanted to, you can make it red, make it look really cool. You can change his mouth color, skin color. I'm just going to make them all blue just to show you. Okay, I'll re-equip it. <laughs> Look how awesome that is. Super vibrant blue. <laughs> yeah, you can go nuts with these. That's why I like the skins. This thing's pretty cool too. But again, I prefer the tech saddle versus the tech skin. <laughs> that still looks pretty sweet. So there's the Mosasaur, the last one. I almost forgot it. <laughs> uh, if you like my videos, consider subscribing and uh, leave a like. And thanks for watching. Stay frosty. <laughs>